prepare your palates. The Columbia Food and Wine Festival kicks off in less than two weeks. That's right. And over the past several weeks, we've been showcasing some of the culinary talent that will be on display at the festival. And this Foodie Friday, we are joined by the beautiful ladies, Michelle Richards and Peggy Boggess with Abundant Grace. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. Good morning. All right. We are so excited to talk about charcuterie boards. I yes. feel like they're so popular right now. Mm -hmm. Everybody wants to be able to have one at their party and mm -hmm. show it off. And you have one for us right this morning. We do. All right, tell us about it. So we create charcuterie boards and we do grazing tables where you do charcuterie on your surface. We do workshops yeah. and we deliver here in the Midlands area. Oh, I love that. So this really all started during the pandemic. How was that for you all during that? Because as we all know, this really <laughs> blew up during it. So many people were at home. Yeah. It did blow up. We'll be uh, four years old next month. Wow. So we've been working together and um, it was, it's amazing. Mm -hmm. It's been amazing. We had no idea that this little idea that we had would just be our full-time jobs now. Oh, wow. I love this. Now I have to ask, since you are our charcuterie experts, <laughs> what is really necessary to have a charcuterie <laughs> board that mm -hmm. impresses, that pops, that people want to come to? So you want to have a lot of variety, which is nice for a charcuterie board because there's something for everyone. Mm -hmm. And you want to um, make things in bite size. Yes. So you don't want to come up with a hunk of brie and stick your knife in. Mm -hmm. um, you want to cut it in slices or cubes. You want to um, have a variety so that when you place it, it balances out. So you have like cheeses in different areas, meats in different areas. Textures. Yeah, textures. Colors. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And just then um, just a variety of cheese when you think of it mm -hmm. soft cheese and hard cheese semi-soft mm -hmm. semi-hard and something for everyone a spicy meat a, a mild meat yeah. wow you're giving us a lot of a lot <laughs> of stuff yeah. there in the <laughs> oh, making you hungry <laughs> okay you're making us hungry over there. and also to the details i love the fact that you mentioned you guys do classes so do you go into details on what needs to be on there and kind of how you make this into this beautiful we do. ribbon? We do, we do. It's, they're all hands-on and they get to come home with their own charcuterie board that they make. Okay, oh. I have to ask, mm -hmm. can you please show us just how to fold one of the meats? <laughs> I, 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 I find meat folding to be so interesting. Uh, okay. A little trip. So okay. prosciutto comes in a ribbon. Okay. Yeah, and so we fold it in half. Okay. <laughs> and then it's really hard to work with. And then you just weave it back and forth. Like and kind of, of pinch it candies. at the bottom. Mm -hmm. See? And there you go. You made it look so easy. Uh, I'm going to let y'all know. We sell a lot of prosciutto. <laughs> yeah. If I tried that right now, it would look like origami gone wrong. So I'm going to leave it to the experts. Now, I do want to ask, how excited are you guys about participating in the Food and Wine Festival? Oh, we're oh, so excited. Yes. We did it last year. This is our second year, and we are so happy to be back. And we have two events this year we're a part of. Yeah, tell us about them. So we're part of the Mix, Mingle, and Glow, which will yeah. be Friday the 26th at Skin House. Um, that's that's like be, their self-care event fun. this year. Nice. It's kind of out of the norm. It's a, one of the more intimate events of the Food and Wine Festival. And then we're part of the Grand Tasting on Sunday, Ooh. which is the big event. So, wow. Yeah. Oh, that's amazing. Huge congratulations to you, you all, too. This is the second time here. That is absolutely beautiful. And so really quickly, where can people find you, maybe to learn classes or to learn more about you all? Our website at AbundantGraze.com. Mm -hmm. And you can be here on Instagram and Facebook also. So please check us out. Absolutely. Ladies, thank you so much. We appreciate you guys. And of course, if you want to be able to check out our friends at the Food and Wine Festival, make sure to go ahead and grab those tickets. We know a lot of those events are selling out fast. Yes. All right, friends. Thank you so much. We appreciate y'all joining us yeah. this morning.